Tanya al Khouri. I am speaking to you now from Beirut, where I have been uh, stuck <laughs> for a while. Uh, I'm a live artist. Uh, I work mainly in interactive installation and performances. So I've had a lot of uh, cancellation um, since uh, the coronavirus uh, lockdown started around the world. Um, Because I work mainly in live performance uh, that requires people to come together, sometimes touch each other, sometimes uh, be very close and intimate, uh, uh, intimate space next to each other. So a lot of these uh, works um, that were booked uh, this year were uh, unfortunately cancelled. Some of them uh, switched to become digital version of them. Others uh, were postponed for next year. But uh, what what was more interesting is all of these conversations um, that happened in the industry around our relationship to audience, our responsibility towards audience, um, and uh, the future of uh, our industry. I think everyone who works in live performance now, it being intimate performance or a big uh, events uh, or concert is now rethinking the nature of their work. So I've always thought about um, my responsibility towards audience, how the audience experience the work, uh, I've never um, kind of thought about my um, audience as just a spectator, but always involved in the work. And with that comes the ethical responsibility towards what experience these audiences are going through. Um, and I've always been inclined to using very um, a small number of audience at a time. And uh, because it wasn't always feasible, um, financially for programmers. I've always been pushed or advised uh, to work for, uh, with bigger audiences and I never really um, listened to that advice. So it's been interesting now that some uh, programmers have kind of reached out to me saying, we think your work would fit uh, well now when we reopen because we're not allowed, especially in Europe, they're not going to be allowed to have a big number of audiences. So they are being asked uh, by their governments to reopen but limit their audience. Um, so now they're actually uh, uh, thinking that this should be the way forward. And if you want to talk about the future of art and uh, the future specifically of live performance and people coming together to experience art, uh, I think it will be tough. It will be a tough uh, future. But at the same time, what I'm interested in is this rethinking of our responsibility um, and the ethics of bringing people together and our responsibility towards audience and what sort of experience we're asking audience to go through.